What are the primary components associated with building a baseline for the facility's current energy consumption? What all needs to be considered? ASHE's Energy to Care program has developed an easy to follow ECM that addresses these questions and helps a facility build a baseline with one or multiple meters. It also discusses commissioning considerations and it outlines how-to steps for implementing the energy baseline. A facility's baseline can serve as the starting point for energy efficiency improvement goals, such as installing a new piece of equipment or retro commissioning, as well as a comparison point for evaluating future efforts and trending overall performance. But there are many concepts to understand to get the most benefit out of the baseline. For example, establishing a base load can help give context to if the energy savings increases are associated with the weather. Also, tracking financials associated with utility rate increases allows for the determination and total avoided cost for energy conservation projects. Aside from the benefits associated with reducing energy consumption and cost, establishing a baseline has a value environmentally and socially. ASHE's Energy to Care dashboard directly ties to Energy Star and establishes an Energy Star score on a 1 to 100 scale, with 50 being the median. Working to improve this score is a great way to convey a message that everyone can understand and shows employees and the community that the facility is running more efficiently while reducing greenhouse gas emissions. Visit the educational tool section on ASHE's Energy to Care website at energytocare.org backslash educational dash tools and scroll through the ECMs for a how-to guide with associated benefits, case studies, and commissioning considerations.